It's been vacant, burned out, a burned out mess really for many months, and it's finally coming down. The former Frank Beard Elementary School over on Waterman in southwest Detroit is set to be demolished by the end of the week. Victor Williams live on the story tonight, and this is such great news for this neighborhood, Victor. Oh, yes, yeah, Sandra and Karen. For the past two months, this place has been the textbook definition of the word blight, and it doesn't take much to see what I'm talking about. From our angle right here, it looks like the place is falling apart, but thankfully, the city was able to step in with what the district could not do. It was a little heartbreaking, especially when it's another school closed. It's sad, but then when it's burned and abandoned, it's even sadder. For 70 days now, Rosalinda Garza has had to look at the eyesore of a building that used to once be the thriving Frank Beard School that burnt down back in late July and was set on fire again in August. You hear like sirens, so you just say, oh no, what else is burning or something that's been burnt, burning a gun. Abel Jones says it's had a negative impact on the community. It's hard to make your place look good when you got this next to it. Um, it's unfortunate it did burn down, but it is what it is. Now, thanks to the city stepping in with an emergency demolition, the burn remains are being knocked down this Friday. Detroit Demolition Department Deputy Director Tim Palazzolo says it's part of the same reason why the historic Packard plant had to come down. Uh, our mission is to protect and promote the health, safety, and welfare of Detroit neighborhoods. Detroit Demolition Department Director Lawan Count says it's all being done to eliminate blight on a grander scale. We have over 300 commercial properties that we are actively looking into doing um, demolitions on. Um, and then there's another 400 or so that we are researching to see should they transition to the demo list or not. We want to eliminate blight and improve those these neighborhoods around here. This is a great neighborhood. Obviously, there's a lot of investment going on in this area. DPSCD will now be in control of what happens to the space going forward. But at least for now, the future is bright. I'm glad to see the city moving on it and making our community better. It's nice to see something new coming up, something so, um, so beat up, so burnt up to go down. And we'll have video of that demolition this upcoming Friday. We'll also be talking to some of the neighbors here to see what they have to say that the building is soon going to be gone. Victor Williams, Local 4. The eyesore gone and room now for changes in development. All right, thank you, Victor.